Well, from sun to snow. So if you watch the evening forecast, Brandon always has the photo of the day, and this is a pretty cool one that was sent in yesterday. Uh, they're actually little rolls of snow, and here's how those are formed. Taking you inside the forecast, you get pretty strong winds, and that again creates the snow rollers. All it does is basically push that little dense chunk of snow along some lighter snow and Creates a snowball. Pretty crazy, huh? Waking up to 38 degrees right now in Gray Falls, 25 in the capital. Much colder, though, still in northeastern Montana. And the reason for that big stationary front camped out across Montana. That's keeping the cold Arctic air well to our north and east. Slightly more mild down to the south and west. Today's high temperatures again. There it is. That split stationary front keeping the cold air up to the north and east. Teens in northeastern Montana, 28 in Haver, looking at 41 in Gray Falls and a couple of 30s just west of the divide as well. As for your future track today, can't rule out a couple little isolated flurries in northeastern Montana. Really over the next couple of days, every day will present the chance of just some little isolated sporadic flurries making their way throughout the area, but really very little in the way of accumulation, more or less into northeastern Montana. That's where you could see actually maybe a little bit of measurable accumulation there, but pretty minimal with most of the snow staying over the mountains. Today we are talking about wind around 9 930. We should see that wind ramp up a little bit, very similar to yesterday, maybe slightly stronger at times 20 to 30 for most of central Montana, just enough to make it feel a little bit colder out there. Overnight lows cooling quite a bit, especially again on the high line and northeastern Montana single digits there 28 in Gray Falls, 31 in the capital, a couple of 30s west of the divide. Tomorrow continuing to regain some strength when it comes to the temperatures. Well above seasonal averages in Gray Falls, 47. Still a little bit cooler, though, in northeastern Montana. Closer to average in Haver, 42 in Lewistown. As we head toward the weekend and through the remainder of the work week here, uh, that stationary front just stays camped out. Really doesn't do much for us except keep that colder air to the north and east. We're going to continue to see some moisture try to push in off of the Pacific coast and when that moisture meets up with that colder air mass right along the leading edge is where we'll see the best chance of some of those flurries kicking off. That'll be the case up through the weekend. So really sporadic flurries not out of the question over the next couple of days. Here's how all that plays out on the next seven. Going to be looking at uh, 41 today. Windy at times much warmer tomorrow. Check it out. 47 getting a little bit cloudy though. Strong possibility of some evening fl uh, flurries there, but very uh, light sporadic. Likely very, very little in the way of accumulation. Same story in the capital, 40 degrees and then a few flurries Friday into Saturday, Keeley.